All right, so we're ready to run and set this up so that we're going to run first time with all our components connected. Uh, so we've got the monitor, we've got the, the breadboard, we've got our uh, motion sensor connected through the breadboard to the Raspberry Pi, which we want to do because we are running voltage and any over voltage can ruin the chip. Uh, so now that we have all that set, it's just going to be just a matter of taking it and plugging it in and making sure it goes through all of the steps. Um, part one uh, got us to the point where we know that this is going to boot up and load directly into uh, the family calendar. Uh, that's the Chromium kiosk mode. So we have that all set. Uh, we also know uh, that through the script that we downloaded and installed, uh, we will be using Faye and Faye will then load us into the slideshow. Uh, so what we're trying to accomplish here is we want to make sure that after a certain amount of time, if that motion sensor is triggered while the uh, slideshow is running, the escape button will be pressed and after it's pressed, that'll escape from the slideshow and then restart the clock so that we see the calendar again. Okay, uh, this is all here. Now we just have the time to wait for the um, uh, slideshow to turn on, which is about 60 seconds. So we're just going to wait for that, uh, make a little motion as possible so as to not trip off the sensor. And just waiting, waiting, waiting. Okay. We've done a lot to get up to this point. Um, and so this is just our final test before we throw everything together uh, in a nice frame and hang it on the wall. All right, waiting. All right, we've got to this point. We know that this works. So then if I put my hand in front of the motion sensor, I trigger the escape. Yes, success. It goes out of uh, the slideshow mode and right back into the calendar, which is awesome. That counter starts again. So we have to take everything here now and stick it behind. And that's going to be our next step is putting all of these components into it and flipping it over and then putting it in the picture frame so that we can hang it on the wall. Uh, so uh, stay tuned. <laughs> 